it's hopefully, hopefully, uh, you know, in that way, uh, you can make fish, but uh, if not, I'm also confident all our players are good enough, and confident, uh, confident enough uh, to overcome this thing. Um, yeah, just my feeling on, on tomorrow night and the, the, how the boys are feeling. Um, first of all, it is a massive honour to wear this badge. Um, to put the yellow and black colours on is, is a huge honour to um, in, in any sport. And um, to come here uh, to Thailand and, and face a very strong Thailand team the other night, um, the boys felt the pressure that was there because we know how badly the Malaysian public and support um, want something, want something to win, want a cup. And um, we also, as footballers, want to win everything. It doesn't matter what type of game it is, friendly game, exhibition game, um, A-class game, it doesn't matter. Uh, we want to win everything. And I think that's the mindset that we have to take into this game, um, is that we put in good performances and we can get these results. So. Um, we will continue to strive to be better every game and uh, continue to push each other to find out where our limits are and push past those limits. So, um, you know, we will be ready for tomorrow night with the information that we get from the coaching staff and um, we will prepare as well as possible and, um, you know, at the end of the day, we want to be able to come back to Malaysia with the cup in our hands. Personally, do you think that tomorrow will be a Malaysian night? bring the uh, cup finals. It's funny you ask me personally if I think that that's going to happen. Um, I, I know it's going to happen. I, you know, I've been through many challenges in life and um, you know, this is another thing that I will have no negativity, no negative thoughts, only positive thoughts and um, you know, we will all have those, those same positive thoughts in, in knowing that we are good enough to win this and uh, we just have to make sure we put the performance together. Um, then we can, can pick that cup up. I think certain maybe culture, like, uh, physical, could be machine or not, but we can see that I think uh, tactical approach is really different. We are very aware of that and also we are very uh, fully analysis of that. So, I think, yeah, a bit, I feel a bit uh, stronger than. Uh, Quality players, approach, tactical approach also good enough. So it will be a good stage to try and be, to see where we are. So I think I'm exciting. I mean, I want to see, you know, I cannot wait for tomorrow. I want to see our players in action. Because every single game they show me that uh, surprise. Uh, always they give me that, that uh, more than uh, I expectation. So tomorrow, you know, hopefully, you know, our players will uh, continue to show me that uh, they are full confidence and uh, they are ready. Um, I think that the players in this squad have a lot of experience at a high level, um, whether it's AFC or ACL. Um, they understand that to enjoy these moments, but also to be very focused for what is to come as well. We know the job is not done. Um, it is always great to be able to beat Thailand, um, a, a very, very good team and we've always had a good rivalry together. 
but um, we know that we've come here for two games, and um, you know we need to be focused on that. It's it's a a camp that we've come into to get better, to improve every game. So we've played well against Thailand, but we need to keep improving for Tajikistan, and it's not going to be an easy game. But um, with the amount of work that we've done off the field and on the field, um, hopefully that will be implemented into the game tomorrow night. Yeah, well, first of all, you know, going back to the question of what team line up this will happen, this squad is not, doesn't consist of the best 11. We have a squad of 25 that all can play, that all can start, that all can do a very good job. There's no starting 11, there's no best players. Um, we are all selected because the coach thinks that we can fit the tactics, fit the system to the best of our abilities. And uh, whoever plays on the night, it doesn't matter. Everyone has to give their 100%, has to go out there, do a professional job, and take those tactics and implement them in the game tomorrow. So, again, it doesn't matter who will start, who will come off the bench, um, you know, we all have to be ready. And uh, that's the pressures of being in the national team. There's, it's different to club level, um, where you can have some young players come in and, and whatnot, but national team level, everyone has to be ready. And I think that's the best part about this squad right now, is that in training, you can see everyone is hungry. Everyone wants to play, everyone wants to win. Um, there's no 50-50 that you won't go into with 100%. So that is the best part for us. Um, I think the chemistry is, is quite good in, in training. Um, we all work together, we all change teams, we all change bids at the end of the day, and um, you know we all have to be ready. So whoever is in the starting lineup or whoever is on the bench, whoever comes on, um, will we'll do a good job. Uh, it's happy to into final stage. It's very exciting. I think uh, I will fully support our players so that they can prepare well. Uh, I think they could make very meaningful memories close to the final. And also, on my side, you know, I will consecutively you know, fulfill our plans in terms of our strategic plans. So we want to maintain uh, our plans. So, so I try to achieve my side and also I try to help to achieve their side. So we want to uh, look for success for our yeah, it's um, very exciting for the boys to be in the final. Um, it goes to show that uh, the performance that we put on the, the field against Thailand has um, have been an amazing achievement for the boys. So um, we've done very well, but uh, it's not the it's not the end. And um, you know, we've come here to put in good performances first, and then uh, the results will come from those good performances. So. We have a great coaching staff who have done a lot of homework and put in a lot of effort to give us as much information um, as possible and to set us up uh, for us to be favourable in the final. So um, it is up to the players at the end of the day to go on the field and to put in performances. But uh, I fully trust the players. Um, they're an incredible, an incredible bunch of players with a lot of talent. Um, we just have to come together until um, tomorrow night and um, show how good we really are. Yes, I mean, it should be a great achievement you know, after 44 years in Malaysia to get a champion for the King's Cup. So, uh, we will fully be ready. Fight with the uh, Tajikistan, and uh, I think you know. I 
can see that a Kazakhstan the level is such a good team. But I think we also deserve to be in the final. But it would be like a good game. So not only achieve uh, you know, to be a champion, but I'm looking for our players you know, compete with uh, this kind of level, you know, this kind of pressure. You know, like a final game is should be huge pressure for the, our players and also you know, our team ourselves. But we we want the practice to overcome this kind of uh, situation and to be a uh, grow of ourselves to solve the preparation for the future. So we want to show good team spirit, to fight spirit to the Malaysia you know, football fans. We want to give them you know, all proud uh, to them. Yeah, I think we will try our all best.